Hello again, it's Hooves of Doom here with another update on my March of the Tomb Kings project. So, I finished these guys. This is my, um, the project I started, I guess, last Tuesday, or actually uh, a week before Tuesday. And um, I was hoping to get it done in a week. I got a little bit uh, put back by schoolwork. Most of this was actually finished by about Tuesday. The chair just needed a few more touch-ups. So I've actually started on the Bone Giant and Tomb Guard, um, and I, I'm off this next week, so hopefully I can put in some good hours and, and get both of those finished, and um, move on to Shabti pretty quick as well. So that, that's pretty much what I have left. I have to do High Queen Kaleda as well. But otherwise, it's moving along well. So I'm quite happy with these guys now. Uh, these are my skeleton warriors. Um, the the blue I think looks pretty nice. It has a nice accent color across the army. And if you'll notice, I did uh, the darker brown bases after all. I just thought, meh, I'll try them out. I actually do like it. So I think I'll switch the archers. Doing the bases will only take you know maybe an hour or so to switch those up. So. But um, I think that they're looking good. A um, little bit better control, I think, with the airbrush a bit. Um, like I said, I, I like the blue highlights. These chariots, I thought, were pretty nice. Um, there's more that I could do with this army. I could maybe brush up a little bit of the gold, make it look a bit brighter on the edges. But I kind of like the old, uh, a, a tarnished look a bit. And... Um, yeah, the army's coming along fairly nicely, so I'm, I'm excited to get this um, whole army done um, within a month, which is great. So I'll do an update on the uh, Bone Giant and Tomb Guard when those are finished. Thanks for tuning in, guys. Have a good one.